Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do a complete uninstall of Origin. Basically it's going to be like Origin has never been installed on your machine before and this will hopefully fix a lot of errors or problems you've been having with Origin. To start off with you need to go to the link that's in the description below and you'll end up on a page that looks like this. Once you're on this page you need to press free portable and you need to go save file. Once it's finished downloading you need to open up the zip folder and we're just going to drag it to our desktop. Once it's on our desktop we're just going to go into the folder and we're going to run the Revo U port. We're going to right click and go run as administrator and we're going to go OK. Once you've run it, you need to find Origin. As you can see, it was just there, but it's gone now. You can actually type it in at the top as well. Let's just go Origin, and there it is. You need to now press Uninstall, and we need to now press Uninstall. Once Origin's finished installing, you need to press Finish, and we now need to press Advanced, and we want to go on to Scan, and here's a list of all the registry entries for Origin. We just want to click on the top checkbox here and we want to go delete. We want to go yes. And now here's all the directories for Origin that have been left over. As you can see, we've got C programs Origin. We want to basically remove all these folders, but you don't want to remove your games. For example, here I've got Battlefield 1. So I don't want to select that folder, otherwise it will delete Battlefield 1 and then I would have to re-download the whole game again. Just go through and select anything you want to remove. For example, here we've got a .temp file. We don't need that. We don't need the origin uninstall log. We can delete that as well. We can check both of those. Once you're happy with everything that you've selected, you can then press delete and you can go yes. And you now need to go finish. And that is now a complete uninstall of Origin. It's like Origin has never been on our computer before. Now we need to go to the Origin website and download Origin again. You can also delete the Revo uninstaller portable if you don't want it on your machine anymore. If you now head on over to the link that's in the description below, you'll end up on the Origin page that looks like this. You now need to press download and we need to go save file. Once that's finished downloading, we now need to run the setup file. We now need to press install Origin and we can now choose where we want Origin to be installed. The C drive is absolutely fine for me. I want to have a desktop shortcut and I want shortcuts in the start menu. I don't want Origin to automatically run with Windows and I want to keep that checked as well, automatically keep my Origin games up to date. I don't want to share my hardware specifications and I now need to tick. I have read and accepted the Origin end user license agreement. We can now press continue. Once it's finished installing, you'll end up with a sign-in window, as you can see here. And it's as simple as that. We have now got a fresh install of Origin on our computer. Hopefully that has fixed any bugs or errors you were getting with Origin. If it hasn't, comment below and we will see about trying to fix those errors. I hope this video helped. If it did, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.